Hey y'all, how everybody doing today? It's me, Life with ANC, coming at you with this quick video. I had already started because I wasn't going to do no video, but I said, let me go ahead and get them a little something today. I got a McDonald's fish sandwich and, of course, them fries. Yeah. She doing it. She doing bad today. It's okay, though. I'm going to walk later on. Mm-hmm. The Friday afternoon walk. I'm going to hit that thumbs up. Like it like. That was going to forget, didn't you? Subscribe if you like what you see. Mm-hmm. If you like what you see, then subscribe to me. This is Life with AMC. The place you want to be. And guess what? I'm not a big T fan because the movie's coming up. We had an air day just about for Kool Aid. Kind of tired, but I got a sweet tea in honor of Coco T TV. Mmm. Y'all. I had no McDonald's fries in a minute. Mmm. 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 Mm. Now the holiday coming upon us. Now to start your Christmas shopping. Start a cooking for the holidays. Some people start baking and freezing stuff early, but. I like my stuff fresh. Plus, I'm going to Texas, so I'm be carrying nothing on no plane. Carrying no mac and cheese on the plane. Mmm. Look, I like to put fries on my family. Mm-hmm. I'm still on my healthy lifestyle journey as I eat these fries and fish don't. But that's why I say I'm not on a diet. I'm not following a plan. My plan is to try to eat healthier. Try to Be more health conscious and realistic at the same time. Because I know me, I love to eat, so I'm not going to sit up here and say I ain't going to never eat certain stuff again because I'll be lying. Not on, on no plan, but I can't have this, can't have that. I do try to cut back. On certain things. Like chips, for instance. Love me some chips. Don't buy them anymore. Don't keep them in the house. If I have an urge for chips, I go buy a bag at the store. A small bag. The set, I think. I forgot how many ounces. At the convenience store and eat that. I don't keep dangerous items around. If I want something sweet, I go get it. Sometimes I make something, you know, try to make something healthier. But yeah, if I want some, I'm gonna eat it. Like one of these fish channels today. But this is a lifestyle thing. This is something I got to do for a lifestyle. So I finally figured out after all these diet Fast fixes, diets, pills, shots. Something you gotta work at every day. So I've been successful in keeping my weight under 200 for two years. Haven't done that in a while. And I've got gotten down to a weight that I haven't seen in over 20 years. So it's all about 
being more health conscious and realistic. Because if you like me, you like to eat, I can't do a diet. I'd rather just try to do better, make healthier choices daily. But then if I want to eat something, it's bad, I will. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm going to cut back on dairy a lot. I use almond creamer, almond milk. Don't eat eggs like that anymore. I still eat eggs, but not a lot. I try to just eggs. Mm -mm, plant based, no good. So, still use regular eggs. We use the whites more, more so, unless I'm making something that requires eggs. Um. Added more fruits and vegetables, even though I wasn't doing bad with the fruits, fruits and vegetables. I just start adding more, especially when I'm snacks for my snacks. Y'all, it's all about a healthier lifestyle. Cause I don't like to label stuff like I'm on a diet or go by a plan. Because what? What about when the plan is over? What you gonna do then? Back to your normal eating? Or you're trying to you're on a diet trying to get to a certain weight loss goal. When you get to that goal, are you gonna start back eating? Or are you gonna stay on that same whatever diet or fix you on? You can't do that your whole life. So it's about being more conscious. cook way more at home now than I have been doing. Get the food right out my garden. That's about to be over though. Yeah. It's all about trying to make healthier choices. Like I said, 80% of the time I make good choices and I've added walking more. I've always walked over the years, but I start, stop, walk six months, stop, don't walk for another six months, start back up. No, it's constant. Now, if I don't move, I feel guilty. Even if I don't walk, I try to move, try to do something. Because it's hard. Losing weight is hard. Especially when you know to eat like me. I know I'm eating bad today. But it's on the bread off. I'm still on my health journey. And I'm not just talking because I got results. Results. Now I can show y'all my results. Y'all don't hear me talking about no diet. I'm on a diet or doing this diet. I might do a shake or smoothies. I do those, but it's not like I'm doing a liquid fast or anything like that. Now, I do do the intermittent fasting. But I don't do it every day. I try to at least do it at least four days during the week. And then as you start doing it more and more, you'll just get used to those time slots of eating. I either try to do um, 10 in the morning till 6 p.m. Don't eat none after 6 p.m. And don't eat anything except till 10, except black coffee. Or 
excuse me, I'll do 11 to 7. If I eat something after 6, I'll take it to 7. I won't eat none after 7 and don't want eat anything till 11 the next day. It's a good cleanser, too. Not your gut. So, yeah. No, so I'll be throwing no shade talking about. She talking about losing weight, but she eating. Yeah, I'm eating this today. I'm not going to eat like this the rest of the day. If I eat anything else, it's what, like 3 o'clock? It'll be some food. So y'all can't be dragging me. Talking about, oh, she thought she was on the way off journey I am. It's a lifestyle journey. <laughs> anyway, I just want to come over here, on here. Say hey, see how you guys doing. Hope you have a great Friday. Enjoy your weekend. And spread plenty of what? Love, love, love. Goodbye.